Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am just back today with a really short, quick Rose Girls haul. I haven't done very many videos lately. I do apologize for that. I haven't done a melted video. I do have my empties in their container. I have been melting so sporadically this month that I just, I felt like I didn't have enough built up for a video, but I probably am gonna be doing one next weekend. So melted video. And then as far as product, I haven't been hauling that much. Like my orders have been like two, maybe three items. And so because of that, I just haven't really felt like it really, like it, I can't really do a video on every single thing that I buy. And I, I'm just not really doing that right now. I may start again, but I've just been super busy with work. There's some other stuff going on in my personal life right now, and unfortunately, wax, as much as I love it, it's had to go on the back burner a little bit. But I am gonna go ahead and do this quick Rose Girls haul. I split this order with Lindsay Love, so I am going to cut these loaves today and send her her half. So I figured if I'm gonna do a video, I might as well do it. I did get a sample, which I promptly lost. I don't even know how that's possible, but I did. I have, like, me trying to get my life together right now is just insane. But um, but I lost the sample, and unfortunately, I can't remember what it was. It was like a donut something. I can't even remember, guys. I'm sorry. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I ordered that I split with Lindsay. And this is just going to be quick and hopefully painless more painless than these past two minutes have been so all right so first off this is a scent i've been wanting to get my hands on for a while this is plum pomegranate vanilla lace you guys know i've been really loving vanilla lace blends vanilla lace is a perfume from victoria's secret it's like one of their it, it used to be one of their core fragrances and then I believe they actually discontinued it. They have it available in some blends right now. Like I know they have like Love Spell Lace, which is Love Spell and Vanilla Lace blended, but they don't just have the plain vanilla lace right now, which is kind of sad because I did I do enjoy that, especially in like the lotion format. But I am glad that a lot of wax vendors have gotten a hold of a vanilla lace dupe because it smells so good in wax. So this is Plum Pomegranate Vanilla Lace, and this is gonna be a fruity perfume scent. This is so freaking amazing. This is one of those scents where like, I sniffed it and my eyes rolled back in my head. It's that good. And that is what the loaf looks like. So I'm just having these gonna half them right down the middle and send Lindsay her half and I will enjoy my half but this is super super good this is uh, uh I could melt this all year long like absolutely all year long now for me vanilla lace reminds me a little bit more of like a fall and winter scent because it is a little bit more like gourmand like there's definitely a vanilla in it but as far as melting it in wax, I could do it all year long. But if you are interested in vanilla lace blends, I have found that most vendors do pour them in the fall and the winter, like up until Valentine's Day-ish is what I have found. But that this one is excellent. Beautiful, beautiful scent. And then this other one is a cologne scent. This one is Tommy Fresh. This one is Aqua De Gio Shaving Cream and Oak Moss. This is something that I knew right away that Lindsay Love would love. She loves her sexy man right out of the shower scents. That's exactly what this smells like. It's so good. This is such a good, like manly, fresh cologne scent. Now, this is not going to be for everybody, but I love this, and I know Lindsay is going to die for this. So, so, so good. 
My lighting is weird, but it's gray wax with like a teal, with teal chunks. It smells so good. This is one of those ones where I could literally just set this in the middle of the table, walk away, and it would scent the room just on cold throw. That is how strong it is. Very, very good. And then last but not least, we've got Nilla Blackberry Noel. Now this is a brand new blend. This was actually voted on by the customers. She had a poll, Jenny put up a poll with several different options. This was the top choice. Now, as you guys may know, Nilla Strawberry Noel. Nilla Strawberry Noel is my absolute favorite Rose Girl scent. It's a little bit of an obsession with me. So I wanted to take a chance on this one because I've been really loving Blackberry this year, as you guys know. So Nilla Blackberry Noel is Nilla Wafers, Blackberry, and Vanilla Bean Noel. I did only get one pack of muffins which I instantly regret. This is so good. Her blackberry, I think, is my favorite blackberry. It's definitely a juicy, fruity, delicious blackberry. It doesn't have that perfumey note in it. I've heard some people say that it does, so maybe, I, I mean, everybody's noses are different. I never smell the perfumey note in this blackberry. This is just juicy, fruity, deliciousness. Oh, I love this. Now, strangely enough, this one is not as bakery to me as Nilla Strawberry Noel because her strawberry jam that she uses in her Nilla Strawberry Noel is almost a bakery scent in itself. I've melted it by itself, and it almost smells bakery to me more than fruity. So that one is like super gourmand, kick you in the face, amazing bakery. This is more of a even balance between fruity and bakery. I really get the juicy blackberry in this. So I'm glad I took a chance on this. I mean, it was just kind of a no brainer to me. I was like, well, I got to get a pack of muffins. So I'm, I'm loving this. I actually love everything about this order. She had a ton of like super popular scents and a lot of like pumpkin and fall and cider scents available. I'm so well stocked on fall scents that I just, I, I went the other route. I went for fresh and perfumey, cologne type scents this time around and just placed this little order and called it good. But yeah, so that is it. Super short video. I think she's probably going to do one more pre-order at, one more pre-order at least before Christmas because she's, they've really been cranking these out. Like they went from six to seven week turnaround time to like barely four at this point. Like they are really cranking out the wax. So I, I foresee at least one pre-order between now and Christmas time, which is exciting. I love her Christmas time stuff. She usually does like the Mario scents and some of the like old school throwback Rose Girl stuff, which is always super exciting to me. But that is it for this video, short, sweet. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will be back as soon as I can with a melted video and I do have a couple other little hauls that I need to show but um probably not this week things have just been things have been kind of crazy I'm okay but things have been crazy and I just haven't been able to take the time out to film and upload like I usually do so I apologize but I will be back see you guys in the next one have a good one bye